you've probably heard of fight or flight, which is the response the body has to stress or fear. Let's use the interactive 3D models in Human Anatomy Atlas Plus in Physiology and Pathology to walk through the body's fear response. A chain reaction is triggered when you perceive a threat. First, your amygdala sounds the alarm. The amygdala is part of your brain that, among other things, connects memory and emotion. The amygdala calls upon the hypothalamus, which acts as your body's switchboard, sending signals to the rest of your endocrine system. That's how the message gets to the adrenal glands. You have two adrenal glands, one atop each kidney, and they produce and release hormones directly into the bloodstream. In the stress response, the adrenal glands release epinephrine and norepinephrine. Epinephrine signals a number of changes in the body that you might recognize. Your lungs expand and the rate of respiration increases, so your body takes in more oxygen to deal with the threat. Your heart beats faster. Your pupils dilate and your muscles begin to tense up. The body deems some functions like digestion unnecessary in a dangerous situation and begins to slow them down. If the threat sticks around, the hypothalamus, pituitary, and adrenal glands get ready for round two. The hypothalamus releases a hormone called CRH, which signals the pituitary gland to release ACTH. ACTH in turn signals the adrenal glands to release cortisol, often called the stress hormone. Cortisol helps give the body the energy it needs to stay on high alert for a bit longer by signaling several organs in the body to make changes impacting blood glucose levels. When the threat is over, your body starts to wind back down. Cortisol levels decrease and your body starts to go back to its everyday functions. Want to learn more about the anatomy and physiology of stress? Visible Body Web Suite has all the 3D gross and microanatomy models and physiology animations you need, as well as 3D flashcard decks for studying. Learn more at visualbody.com slash web suite.